Well, more counties may be joining LA if the rise in cases continues. Both state and county officials shared grim numbers and dire predictions today. As KCAL 9's Hermela Aragawi shows us, they continue to sound the alarm about stopping the spread. Bottom line is we are looking at intensive care unit capacity as the primary trigger for deeper, more restrictive actions. California could once again be under strict stay-at-home orders as the number of COVID-19 cases in the state hit record levels, putting pressure on hospital capacity. Here in the Southland, 64% of hospital beds are occupied. The governor says that's projected to increase to 79% capacity by Christmas Eve if current trends continue. The numbers for ICU bed capacity are even more alarming. Currently, 74% of ICU beds in the South land are occupied. Hospitals could reach capacity by mid to late December and be at 107 percent capacity by Christmas Eve. Case numbers that we've seen in the last week and 10 days have not even begun to impact hospitals yet. We know that it takes about two weeks so a few days ago when we had a case level of 18,000 plus cases in the state, what that tells us is that's not yet impacted the hospitals, the emergency rooms, the ICUs. LA County officials also outlined new temporary stay-at-home orders that went into effect today. Also today, Health Director Dr. Barbara Ferrer says the county reached a grim milestone of more than 5,100 new COVID-19 cases, bringing the county's total to 400,000. We are at the most difficult moment in the pandemic. While we're aware that there are many that are tired of repeated requests to sacrifice and others that are unhappy and frustrated. The governor says California expects to have about 300,000 doses of a vaccine by mid-December. His working groups will make recommendations about the first phase of distribution. Hermela Argawi, KCAL 9 News.